in a soft drink world dominated by Coke and Pepsi that seemingly caters only to mainstream tastes, there's still room for a maverick. Since 1987, Seattle-based Jones Soda has carved a small but significant niche in the industry with an unconventional approach. There's so many different like choices out there. We had to find a way to really, really connect with everyone in a unique way. Jones Soda makes a cola and root beer, but it's the eye-catching flavors like berry lemonade, strawberry lime, and blue bubble gum that draw curiosity. The blue bubble gum is pretty, it's pretty tasty. I like that. But Jones really pushes the envelope in its holiday specialty packs flavors. I'm trying Christmas tree. <laughs> Smelling like the woods here, but here we go. It's not bad. <laughs> Sweet potato soda. I don't think these are going to surpass colas anytime soon. This is a Christmas ham. I'm going to try. How do you make a soda taste like a ham? To solve that riddle, Jones turned to its business allies, the flavor chemists at Virginia Dare Extract Company in Brooklyn. When I saw it on paper, I kind of laughed. It was, it was surprising that somebody would want to drink something like this. Using various chemical compounds and years of experience, the chemists assemble a flavor formula to emulate each food's taste characteristics. A simple taste test helps ensure the formula's taste is as close as possible to that of the target food. Smoke is just right past the uh, meaty notes. So we did a good job. We did a good job. Okay. <laughs> oh, oh he's going no for the whole thing. Way. I definitely got the, the aftertaste of the ham. <laughs> I, I, no need for Thanksgiving or Christmas. It's not really here. bad now. In addition to its distinctive flavors, another concept individual to Jones is the way it labels its bottles. People can send in a photograph of their favorite moment, and anybody has a chance to get on to a soda bottle. You know, only Michael Jordan can get on Wheaties, but uh, anybody can get on a bottle of Jones. And if you want to guarantee your picture will make it onto a bottle, my Jones is a, is a very unique uh, process for Jones Soda. Upload a photo to the website, and uh, we'll send 12 bottles to their door, uh, whatever flavor they want, um, with their picture on it. In recent years, Jones Soda wedged its way into two soft drink markets once reserved only for the cola giants. The first, commercial airline beverage service, with its partner, Alaska Airlines. The second, the Seattle Seahawks concession stand. Out of all the NFL football teams in the country, I think uh, 14 serve Pepsi, 16 serve Coke, and one serves Jones. To produce a specialty pack of sodas tailor-made for football fans, Jones once again tapped the expertise of the flavor chemists at Virginia Dare. Uh, they've asked us for a grass flavor and a dirt flavor. And since smell and, and taste are so closely associated, everybody knows what grass and dirt smells like. So I tried to formulate flavors that smelled like these items rather than actually tasted like them. Perspiration, it's quite unusual that you want to drink it, but there's a distinct odor to perspiration. And we're able to emulate that with some of the compounds we have here. Well, that's nice. It's actually a little difficult to drink. When it comes to flavors meant to taste good, Jones means business, as it produced six million cases in 2007. Uh, we definitely have unique flavors, but I think any flavor that we put out, even if it is dirt, it's the best dirt you're gonna find in town. <laughs> uh, dirty. Uh, yeah, that's not good. <laughs> 